On daybreak and later tonight, Western New York's tech scene will be out in full force. It is the ninth annual 43 North Finals. The startup competition will be giving away $1 million to five different companies in a competition that's sort of like Shark Tank. The semifinalists will take the stage later tonight at 6 p.m. Now this morning we know who the companies are that will be competing for that million dollar prize. Here's a look at the eight companies and their founders who will be giving the most important pitch of their lives. They are Stepwise, Cav, Credit Academy, Afterlife, Guidesley, Reese, Store Cash, and 42 Sensors. And five of those companies will soon call Buffalo home and will start their businesses growing right here in Buffalo. And this morning, we're being joined by the, one of the 43 North competition winners from last year, Al Bors, the CEO of Twipes. Thanks for being here this morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Hey, thanks for being here. And talk about your product. How did you come up with the concept and, and what is it all about? Sure. Twipes are the world's first truly flushable, truly biodegradable wet wipes. We're wet wipes that break down in water in just three hours and biodegrade in landfill in just seven days. So it's a truly eco-friendly product. And so many people use them. We actually had a, an issue here in Western New York a few years ago where it was clogging up the system. So this is a smart idea. It certainly is. So how did you learn about 43 North and what was it like for you to become part of that competition? What led you there? It's, it's been a wild journey. We actually applied to 43 North several years in a row. Mm -hmm. And that's the great part of it is um, even if you don't make it through to being a winner, they help support the semifinalists, they help support the finalists, and they kind of support us, guide us through the journey until we got to a stage when we were ready for the competition. And what was that competition like for you? How nervous were you on that stage presenting your company and trying to win that million dollar I'll prize? I'll put it this way, I'm excited that I don't have to present this year. <laughs> <laughs> and as you, you won the million dollars, you committed to Buffalo for a, a year. Do you plan to stay here and, and how much has your company grown since then? What has it done for you? It's, it's been wild. You know, we moved uh, in December during the middle of that historic snowstorm. Mm. That was a crazy time <laughs> to move here, I'd say. What a time. <laughs> your but, whole journey in Buffalo has been crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, after that, it's like you kind of just fall in love with the city because it's like, oh, you've been here when there's nothing open and it's the worst of the worst and it's just up from here. Mm -hmm. um, since then, we've hired nine staff here. We're now in the process of moving manufacturing to Western New York as well. So that's going to be a huge facility we're setting up here to produce our product here. The next steps for us is producing flushable feminine hygiene products, mm. which is going to be huge for us. That's within the next two years. So it's the growth journey has been insane and we're very, very thankful for the support of Western New York as a whole and for everyone here just kind of believing in us. Quite a success story. I've got goosebumps right now. Such a success story for your business, but also for Western New York yeah. to be able to you know, be this incubator for you. It's it's incredible to see, you know, uh, outside of uh, Western New York, you know, I'm from London, England, and over there when people say Buffalo, all we think of is the Buffalo Wings and the NFL. Mm -hmm. So it's great <laughs> now that, we're, you know, one of the other competition finalists this year, we're the ones who told them, hey, you guys should look into this and apply. And they're like, oh, wow, I hadn't heard of this. So it's, it's great to see it now putting, you know, Buffalo on the map. Fantastic. Awesome. And really quickly before we go, any last minute advice for those who will be competing tonight? I don't want to put any pressure on those competing tonight. Just tell them to enjoy it. But I will say to the viewers at home, if you haven't got your tickets yet, and if you happen to not be watching the Sabres home opener tonight, go to 43north.org and you can get tickets for tonight's event. All right. Some great advice there for us. All right. Thanks so much for being with us this Thank morning. And congratulations me. to you and much success in your future. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you. And again, that 43 North competition is tonight and tickets are still available and they're free too so you got to catch it. And if you're not going, then you can also watch it on the live stream. Yes, there is much more daybreak still to come here this morning.